Hi everyone, what's up? Joshua here with Alternative Brewing. And today we're here to check out Brewista's Artisan Gooseneck Variable Temperature Kettle version three. This stunning looking kettle has seen popularity now through three different versions. And this latest model boasts an increased capacity, a slight change in design and program features that make this not only a great kettle for brewing coffee, but would equally brew a quality tea as well. The Artisan Kettle comes in a few different color variations, including the black with wood accents and the white on the white that you see here. And if you're looking to shop the Artisan Kettle, you can by following this link up above and stay with me now to see what's new on the Brewista Artisan Kettle version three. To start with, the Artisan Kettle is a full stainless steel kettle inside and out, with those stylish wood accents in the lid and the base made from BPA-free plastic. The kettle now has a one liter capacity and it operates off 1200 watts of power. The shape to the spout, known as a gooseneck spout, this assists in slowing down and controlling the flow of water whilst brewing. And the Artisan Kettle would be a great choice for pour over style coffee brewing, as you can ultimately get really close to the brewer and then manage the flow of water into the coffee grounds for those best results. And that curved handle is very comfortable to hold and it doesn't get hot even after the kettle's boiled. The kettle connects to the flat base quite smoothly. You begin heating the kettle up by pressing the on and off button and a touch sensitive display reads your current water temperature with the default heating temp set at 85 degrees Celsius. And then by pressing the thermometer button, you can cycle through nine preset temperatures on the kettle or get even more specific with the temperature setting you require using the plus and minus button found in the middle. Now, the temperature range on the Brewista Artisan is from 40 degrees Celsius to 100 degrees boiling, which is a huge range to work with. And you're gonna be able to focus on many styles of tea as well as hone in on the extraction of a coffee during brewing. And the kettle will be twice when the temperature you've set has been reached. But if you prefer, you're also able to turn this beeping off. The Artisan Kettle has a fast boil feature that when pressed, aims to have your water boil as fast as possible. And in tests, it consistently boiled a full liter of water in under six minutes. There's also a keep warm function indicated by the flame under that, and this will hold your kettle's set temperature once reached for upwards of an hour. Built into the kettle though, is a safety auto off function. And this will shut the kettle off altogether if it is left undetended for over an hour. But it will display that current water temperature within the kettle right up into the point it shuts off. The Brewista Artisan Kettle will also remember your set temperatures between switching it off and back on again. Now, you can also cycle through Celsius and Fahrenheit, and the final feature on the kettle is an inbuilt timer. Every time you lift the kettle off the base, the timer will display in the LCD screen. Press the timer button, and it will automatically begin counting upwards from zero. And this is a great feature to have if you're using the kettle for any style of brewing, whether it's tea or coffee, as then you can keep an eye on the brew time quite easily based off of the time that you've removed the kettle to use it. And for all those who prefer a quieter operation of the kettle, you can turn that beeping off by removing the kettle from the base and then holding down the plus and minus button at the same time. And that's the Brewista Artisan Gooseneck Variable Temperature Kettle version three for you. Now I've said it before and I'm gonna say it again. This is a very ergonomic kettle for brewing tea or coffee. It's fantastic looking and it has the capacity to be your go-to kettle for all your hot water needs. So if you have any questions on the Brewista Artisan Kettle version three, throw them in the comment section down below and we'll get straight back to you. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon on your screen and then that way you stay notified when we bring out new videos just like this every week. If you've enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.